A Stuttgart man is dead and two are in custody after a shooting Wednesday afternoon. Police are not releasing what led up to the crimes, but they do expect more arrests. KRK 4's Rebecca Jeffrey is live in Stuttgart where she has learned that this homicide has a connection to another Stuttgart shooting that happened last week. Rebecca, what do we know? Well, Bob and Ashley, police here in Stuttgart have not said if the t if yesterday's shooting was in retaliation of last week's shooting, but I've learned through the prosecutor's office that the two victims from each shooting case are brothers, which is leaving a lot of unrest in their neighborhood. Patrols have picked up around East Cleveland Street in Stuttgart, where pieces of crime scene tape linger. So do feelings of unease. This ain't never happened. Never. Linda Lowe was inside her home a couple doors down when she heard gunshots around 2.30 Wednesday afternoon. And then I heard, doo -doo 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 -doo. there was about 40 shots. Police say at least one person was hit, 20-year-old Zach Jeans. And I seen him when he was holding himself there and he was dragging his leg and they were trying to get him to the hospital. He eventually died. Both Linda and Darius Dawson knew of him. Oh, don't nobody really win in, a, in that type of situation. You know? Stuttgart police are now holding two people for questioning in the case. You know, two families that's heartbroken. The shooting comes one week after Ricola Jeans, Zach's brother, was shot multiple times here on North Rose Street. Ricola is recovering. Both crimes happening a few blocks from each other. Be a sad situation. So two people were arrested in Ricola's case and police have not connected the two shootings. The concern over retaliation is as fresh as this crime scene. People need to start praying more. Yeah. Get out and lose and pray because this is just too much. Stuttgart police believe that more arrests will be made in this case. And just earlier this evening, we saw quite a few law enforcement officers out here saying that they had brought in several other people for questioning in last night's homicide case. But it's still very early in this investigation. We'll keep you updated as we receive more details. Live in Stuttgart, I'm Rebecca Jeffrey for KRK4 News. Back to you.